What's up guys, Skittle Rampage here. So today we're at Pops and Sons and it's their one year story anniversary. So we're gonna be taking a look around, seeing what kind of pops they have and just showing you around the store. So let's check it out. All right guys, so we are walking in. We have Captain Pops right here. What'd you get? Yeah, I, got some, I got some serious loot today. We got the autograph of Kaido as well as the voice of Black Knight as well, David Sabalov, here at Pops and Sons Collectible Sign today. So I had to come down here and get my, uh, my chance to get this. Yeah, guys, so just as he said, the voice of Kaido is actually here as well from One Piece. I actually got something signed uh, right before I started making this video, and it's actually a giveaway for you guys during the 100K stream coming soon here, so stay tuned for that, but right back there signing. But yeah, like I said, guys, we're just going to be going around the store, kind of showing off the really cool grails and other pops they have, so let's look around. Okay, so as you walk in this first wall here, they do actually have a bunch of kind of like mid-range pops here. We have some Space Jam, Matrix... Uh, Batman Chrome, Daria Chase, a bunch of Chases actually, Creed Bratton, Freddy Funko's Green Ranger is really nice. We have Steve with Glasses, Batman the Dark Knight, Pocahontas, Civil War Falcon, oh Spider-Woman with that official sticker, Tafiti, She-Hulk, some cool stuff here. And then up top there they also do have lots of different Funko sodas and a Captain Pops statue. Oh! oh. <laughs> now right here for any card collectors, they do have a bunch of stuff on display here, some really cool stuff. Oh, check that out. That's really nice. They have some plushies down there, and then more cards. And then up here, they actually do have some of the One Piece cards. So they have some starter decks over here, and then they have Pillars of Strength and Paramount War. I might pick up a pack or two. Alright, so here's one of their walls here. This is where they have a lot of the bigger pops. So we have some multi-packs here, like Dapper Dance. I haven't seen that in a hot minute. We also have the Butter 7-pack, some Queen multi-packs, Iron Maiden, some Marvel and Godzilla. Let's see, some two packs here, Mickey Mouse and Jose, Nancy and Robin, uh, Oscar and Trudy from the Proud Family, definitely a cool set to be made. Captain America and Iron Man, Black Bolt, oh that official sticker, nice. Let's see what else have we got here, some bigger pops, we have Kodagiri there, Twice, Hawkman and Cruiser, Sherry and Sunbird, oh Moana there on uh, in Pua on Boat, nice. Tanjiro versus Rui, oh they got the Matterhorn and Bobsled, that's really neat. Um, oh, down here they have a bunch of the, uh, what are those, trading card covers? Lots to see there. Wally and Eve, Marum versus Komagi. Oh, Shark Biting Quint. Wow, that's $100 now? That's wild. I didn't realize it was so expensive. Batman with the Hall of Justice, Dobby. Let's see. Hmm. Luke Skywalker with Tauntaun, I think that's how you say that. Pretty cool. Magic Carpet Ride, Jafar Servant. They've made so many pop moments, it's crazy. Gizmo and Gremlin, the vinyl ones, nice. Zebra and Bullseye Batman. Uh, Wonder Woman, Dark Side on Throne, SS Kill, and SS Khalifa. We have the White Knight 2 pack, Voltron. Oh, 15 bucks is a good price. Bugs Bunny, Looney Tunes, kind of like DVD set. Batman Hush, love that. Bruce Banner, Baymax, lots of bigger pops here. Definitely lots to see. Now they also do have some display cases here. So we have the OG Pocahontas, some Firefly Pops, The Good Place. Wow, I didn't realize those are so expensive from that show. Superman from Flashpoint. We have a Doug, David, Scooby-Doo and Scuba Outfit, Peter LaFleur. I love Dodgeball. So if you haven't seen it, it's a hilarious movie. We have The Hobbit, Gandalf, Blue Eyes, White Dragon, Storm Shadow, Silk, Okoye, and then a couple more, Batman Chase, Jiraiya, oh, Ed Sheeran, haven't seen that pop in a while, and Thor's Secret Wars, and a Strawberry Shortcake pop. On the other side here, we do have Darth Maul, Fun Amount Bears, Lloyd Christmas Chase, uh, Spider-Man, Marvel Collector Core, Luke Hobbs, Great Piece, The Weapon, Babe Ruth, Comic Book Guy, Angus Young, Ice Cube, and Prince. Selena Kyle Chase. Oh, more good place. We have uh, Eleanor. We also have Steen Van Dor. Oh, I forgot they made a Vans Funko Pop. That's definitely pretty cool. Conor McGregor, Mr. Freeze, great piece. They also have Scrubs. Those have gotten more expensive over time. Jason Voorhees, Terror, Vanellope, and Glowing Mr. Burns. Oh, they have a Hannibal Pop. Over in this other case, we do have Batman, the animated series, Poison Ivy, Tafiti, Medusa, Poison Spider-Man. Uh, ooh, Seventh Sister, Star Wars little grail, well, mid grail, it's like 45, 50 bucks. Vegeta powering up, Chase, Hobby the Hopper, Hoppy the Hopperoo, oh, never even knew about that character. We have Guy, Care Bears, Jean Bay, Megavolt, 
another Jason, Swackhammer, he taught you with crows, and then a couple wrestling pops, and MacGyver. Oh, I didn't realize they made a MacGyver pop, that's pretty cool. So here's another one of their back walls, and definitely a lot of stuff here. So we have the new Nezuko and uh, Zenitsu, Target exclusives, Novara, Demon Lisa, pretty cool, Human Torch. Kind of gives you guys just a, let's give you guys a wide view here, there's lots to see. Scorch from Transformers, Zombie Bar, Mr. Meeseeks. Let's see, so much to look at. I don't even know really where to start. We got a Fortnite pop right there. Skull Trooper. Do you like you like Fortnite? I heard. Oh, it's me. <laughs> right here, guys, we have a pretty cool piece. Deathstroke Unmasked. We have Mikasa, Silicon Valley. Mary Poppins, La Yorona, I think that's how you say that. I don't know, somebody told me how to say it, but I don't remember. We also have Knucklehead here, Pop Ranger, Poison Ivy, Elder Skulls uh, Online Morrowind, that's pretty neat. Pennywise Without Makeup, Bumblebee, I don't know. I don't know all these characters, but I'm trying to show you guys as much as possible here. Chucky, Onward, Geralt, Twinkie the Kid, I remember when this one released, that's pretty cool. We also have Captain Crunch, Sugar Bear, Alien Maggie. Freddy Funko as Hopper, Scooby Dumb, Edgar from Men in Black, Carmen San Diego, Touche Turtle. That's pretty neat. Right here's the little DC wall they have here. Lots of Batmans. We have Batman Robot, Chrome, uh, Grim Knight Nightmare. Lots of Batman. Oh my gosh. Let me know if you guys see a Batman that you need for your collection here. Right here we have Ghost, Goose Flurkin, Batman Hush. That's actually one of my favorite ones. Batman Red Rain, 1998, Merciless. Oh, I love that Merciless. If I collected more Batmans, that would definitely be in my collection, but I don't really collect too much Batman, just one I really love. Hellbat's also a really great suit. Two-Face Imposter, Darkter, Harleen Quinzel, Scarecrow Imposter, Aquaman, uh, the Batman Beyond. Oh, the Joker Killing Joke. I have actually had this at one point in my collection. Really, really great piece. We also have another, oh, more Joker. There's lots of Jokers down here, actually. Check that out. All right, so I'm sure you guys are itching to see some of the anime they have, so let's check this out. Up top of One Piece, we have Snake Man Luffy, Jean Bay, Zoro, Tony Tony Chopper. A lot of these are actually restocks that have finally arrived, which is really great. Bonkichi, Soba Max, Sabo, Buggy the Clown, Whitebeard, Usopp, Nami, Nico Robin, Boa Hancock, Frankie there. I think I have pretty much everything I need here, but still pretty neat. We also have a bunch of Pokemon here from the games line. Squirrel Charmander, Horsey, Caterpie, Charmander. I'm trying to see if Bailey needs any of these. I don't think so, but they have lots of good ones. Glaceon Flocked, as well as Espeon Flocked, Ugiora, Arcanine. This Ugiora is like very weirdly placed in the Pokemon section. <laughs> Over here we have some Demon Slayer, a lot of the older commons and exclusives. Tanjiro with Noodles, Meat City, uh, Tanjiro, Rengoku, Rui, and then some of the newer stuff here as well. Tameo, Sabito, Susamaro. No chase than that I'm seeing. They might have one up front. Yahaba. Uh, let's see. Oh, Makamo. But, you know, you have that new two-pack of those two, so no point in buying the comments, in my opinion. Hisuka, a bunch of Hunter Hunter, Kayak Gone Freaks, Shia Poof. Let's see. Netero, Ichigo. Fully holified Ichigo. We also have some Trigun here. Looks like the whole common set, I think. All right, guys, some more anime pops here. You also might hear the voice of Kaido in the background on a Whatnot Live, but let's check it out. So not anime anime, but we have Avatar here up top. Lots of different ones here and some uh, Korra as well mixed in. We also have some Full Metal here. Uh, oh, they do have Lust. I think this is the last one I need. And then actually, no, I need this one and Alphonse with Kittens to complete the set. Uh, let's see, we have Sword Online here, Fruits Basket, Kyo, uh, we have some My Hero Academia, Fumikage, Endeavor, Tomura, Deku, Himiko Toga, another Toga, Kurigiri, Gran Torino, lots of My Hero here. I don't think I need any of these though, I think I have a majority of these actually. Let's see, Kendo, Monoma, Unbreakable, lots of good ones. Oh my gosh, it just keeps going, there's so many. Let's see, all right, going back over here, we have some Jujutsu Kais in there. Kind of hard to see because of the glare, but Itadori, Megami, another Itadori, Divergent Fist, uh, Panda, the new ones. I don't have this Megami, actually. I don't think I ever found it, or do I? I don't remember. I don't know, I gotta check the collection, but 15's not a bad price at all. Over here they have a couple Yu-Gi-Oh ones like Blue Eyes White Dragon, Toon Dragon, and Red Eyes uh, Black Dragon. We also have the Summon Skull. I do have this one. I don't have the White Dragon or Black Dragon though. I don't know. Do I want one of those? 
I don't know. Now over here we do have some Dragon Ball Z, we have Dodoria here. We do actually have a Zarbon pop that was spotted in Target system, so waiting on that, um, that'll be the perfect duo. We also have Piccolo here, Super Saiyan Rose, also the Glow in the Dark one. Over here we probably have one of my favorite exclusives in the Dragon Ball set, which is the Loot Crate exclusive. I don't know. I always thought the sticker looked really nice. It's, it's kind of a basic sticker, but it looks so good to me. Now up top here we have a bunch of Naruto. We have Killer B, Tsunade, Kotetsu, uh, Sasuke here, Anbuita. I think I have majority of those actually. Asuma, Kibo Takamaru, Mike Guy, Kakashi Anbu, lots of good ones. Alright guys, so over on this wall they have lots of Marvel here. So we have some What If. Um, they should be actually making some more Marvel What Ifs here pretty soon. We also have a bunch of the Loki series. Season 2 is about to happen. Definitely excited for that. Falcon and the Winter Soldier, Hawkeye. Oh, what I'm noticing is a lot of Disney like plus series shows, which is pretty cool, all lined up. We have the fun exclusive Glow in the Dark Scarlet Witch, Clint Barton, America Chavez, some Doctor Strange's. Let's see. Ooh, Superior Spider Man. Great piece there. We also have Wolverine, the uh, yellow and blue suit. OG Venom, Poison Spider-Man, Venomized Ghost Rider, uh, the Mech Strike Venom. Lots of Venomized right here, definitely some pretty cool pieces. Oh, and that's the Miles Venom, definitely neat. So continuing on, we have Thor Holiday here, Vision, Okoye again, Groot Onesie. Oh, this is the one where she has the removable wig, definitely a cool piece. Hulk, Mech Strike, Cersei, Star-Lord, Six-Armed Spider-Man, I do believe I have that one. I do have that Electro, great piece. Maria Rambeau, oh, I don't I don't know if I have that Spider-Man actually. Oh no, I think I do. It should be out of box on my Spider-Man shelf. I don't remember, I have so many Spider-Man. We have Gingerbread Hulk, a bunch of the Gingerbread Pops there. Silk, Wade Wilson, Nightcrawler, and then some Shang-Chi. I don't think I have that Spider-Man, but that's a nice piece. Uh, Layla there from Moon Knight. Still a show I never ended up watching. More Moon Knight and WandaVision. Oh, they have the, uh, the Spider-Man from the Gamerverse, Toxin. Now we also have lots more DC and Marvel. We have some Carnage here, Magneto, Green Lantern, the Imperial set, Flash, Grinning Ultron. Such a great exclusive. Uh, we have Justice League Superman, Wonder Woman String Lasso, oh, a bunch of the Holiday Pops, definitely pretty cool. Abomination there, Logan, love that piece. Might, maybe I'll get that in the future if I want to collect more Wolverine. Uh, we have some Shazam right here, Pedro, Hella there, great one. That's actually one of Bailey's favorite pops. Right here we have Ra's al Ghul, absolutely love that pop too. The Riddler there, Star Sapphire, Mr. Freeze, lots of great stuff here. We have Vibe here. Um, so I actually ended up getting, I got Cisco's autograph not too long ago, but I liked the SDCC one better than the Vibe outfit, so I got that one signed, but this is still a cool pop too. We also have Two-Face right here, Harley Quinn Imposter. Let's see, what else do we have? I'm kind of like scooching along as I'm recording too. It's kind of funny. Uh, Mantis, Spider-Man, Bug Eyes Armor, Iron Man Mark One, great piece from that first 10 years line. Peacemaker, Vigilante. Oh, the light up Iron Man, great one as well. Oh, look at this Drax, I love that comic book look. Okay, so one of the goals I actually have today, guys, is that I'm looking for a Star Wars or Marble Grail that I can give away in my 100K stream as well, because I have tons of anime giveaways, but I also want to kind of like hit the other subscribers I have that collect, you know, Disney, Marvel, Star Wars, etc. So I'm looking for some other stuff like that, and hopefully we can find something in here today. So here's one of their grail cases, guys. They have all kinds of cool stuff in here. We have Flock Chopper over there, signed Giyu, signed Tsunade, William Wallace, Uta from Tokyo Ghoul, Kaguya, Punisher, um, Brumok, Donald. We have a, a translucent right there, great piece. Yome, Shock Trooper. I thought about this Storm Trooper because it's like the old one with the uh, vinyl bobblehead text. It's kind of like, you know, 100 plus pop. I'm looking for like a 100, $120 grail that I can pick up today. Maybe that one, but they also have more Star Wars over there that we'll see in a second. Now they also have Rainbow Bright, Freddy Funko's Chucky, Matt Hooper, Lydia Dietz, Scare Glow, Rumble there. Definitely lots of great ones. We have some Blacklight, Carnage, and Spider-Man. Maybe the Blacklight Spider-Man. That's a nice piece, possibly. Uh, we have the Ghost Rider over there. Spider-Ham's also really good. Thrill Killer, Batman. Jareth from Labyrinth. Uh, Notorious B.I.G. Fred Sanford. Killer Frost with the con sticker. Oh, Slimer's a really great piece. Roadrunner. 
Office Jim Halper, Luna Lovegood, love Luna's character. Okay, so over in their other grail case, we have baby Milo here, $1,500 piece, that's a crazy grail. Freddy Funko's Clown, Stone Cold Steve Austin, and Megatron. We also have the Freddy Peter Pan, Carl and Ellie. They have a glow uh, Kuruma there, great, great piece. Rukia pre-release, Green Jow, and Renji, love it. We also do have the Batman Alamo City, White Lantern Superman, The Flash Chase, Harley Quinn, Batman, Alika Chase, bunch of anime grails here, Ochako, Asuna, Blue Eyes White Dragon. Oh, look at that Spider-Man Gold Eyes, I love it. I do own this one, Peter Parker, one of my favorite pieces. They have the Daredevil there, really great one. Notorious B.I.G., Slim, 1970s Elvis, Darth Maul with the vinyl Boba Head set. I thought about this one. Or maybe this um, Obi-Wan Kenobi as well, really great one. Clone Commander Cody's also a really nice piece. They also have the Chrome Batman and the Joker. I don't know. It might be between one of these for Star Wars. Now, they also have a couple cool Disney ones like Jiminy Cricket, Sorcerer Mickey, Merida, Chernabog. They have the signed Tenya Ida there, also a regular Tenya, and Nejire there. I thought about a Nejire as well. All right, guys, I have landed on a piece that I was going to pick up today, and that is the Carnage Blacklight. Now, also for Loungefly fans, they have a wide variety here. We have the Infinite Deku as well as Todoroki there. Uh, I think this is Aladdin, if I'm not mistaken. And the Evil Queen. This one is Sleeping Beauty, I think. I don't know, I'm not much of a Disney person, but I think that's Sleeping Beauty. Bailey might correct me though. Uh, right here, Merida there, that's pretty cool. The movie Brave. No, oh, Willy Wonka. I was like, no idea, but then I saw the little Oompa Loompa in the corner there. That one's kinda trippy, interesting. Buzz Lightyear there. We have some uh, Frozen, Korra. I have Black Panther Wakanda Forever. I was like, some of these bags I can't even make out. Uh, Buccaneers there, pretty cool. San Francisco 49ers, Seattle Hawks, all kinds of different like uh, sports bags here too, which is pretty neat. Raiders there. Oh, look at these. Is this a bag? It's like a stocking kind of, or like a boot. That's interesting. And on the other side here, they have lots more of Disney bags here. I like the Stitch one and uh, the Mickey Mouse right there. That's pretty cool. We have like Spider Mini, the Pizza Planet, that's pretty neat. Sandy Cheeks. We have some Pokemon bags here, really nice. Another, uh, what is that, Pineapple Stitch or Tiki Stitch or something like that? Pretty cool though. Uh, My Little Pony, wow, I didn't even know they made a bag for that, but that's neat. Um, Tangled there. The uh, Looney Tunes collab one, pretty nice. Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. I actually really like this. I don't really like a lot of Loungefly, but this one's actually really neat. Love the show growing up. Now over on this shelf, they do actually have a lot of ad icon pops. So let's check this out. We have Bob Ross, which Bailey has actually been wanting a Bob Ross pop. So maybe I'll ask her about this one. We also have Big Boy there, Fred, Fred Flintstone, excuse me. Oh, Bozo the Clown, that one's actually pretty cool. 90s Coca-Cola Bear, Mark Hamill, uh, the Spam Can, bunch of Coca-Cola pops, Cherry Coca-Cola definitely. Kind of cool. I don't know, these things are kind of growing on me, but I always think they're really silly at the same time. But yeah, people are buying them if they're making them, I guess. We also have Captain Crook there from McDonald's. Fanta Clown, oh my god, I forgot they made the Fanta Clown. That's hilarious. Punchy, Energizer Bunny, Peter Pez. Uh, toucan there, definitely pretty cool robot. To another toucan, oh, lots of toucans I'm noticing. We also have Queen Elizabeth, Evil Knievel Chase. Uh, down here we have some of the Around the World Pops, which is pretty cool. Uh, Pop Ranger, Freddy Funko, Christmas Sweater, Trouble Board is definitely pretty cool. Uh, and then down here we also do have a bunch of Seinfeld and uh, Office Pops. I'm also noticing on the side here they have a couple more ad icon pops like Buzz from Honey Nut Cheerios, Slurpee Pops, Bullseye Dresses John Hammond. And then we have the Kool-Aid Packet. Again, like I'm telling you guys, some of the silliest Funko Pops like this. I've never would have looked at a Kool-Aid Packet and seen it made into a Funko Pop. It's crazy. We have Fruit Pie the Magician, Ding Dongs. I have Milton the Toaster though, I will say, I have that. That was a gift from a friend, it's a funny pop. Alfred Hitchcock, Stan Lee Patina, Ellen DeGeneres, uh, Kung Fu Kevin, Fluffy, Ricochet Rabbit, some cool little pieces here, honestly. All right, so now for Disney fans, let's check out their selection here. So, we have Dumbo right there, Funko Shop exclusive. We also have Peter Pan, uh, some of the remix pops. Minnie Mouse, that's a pretty nice one. I think if we find a any Halloween Disney ones, Bailey's been looking for those and we might pick one up. Uh, so let's see, we have Mirabelle, Bruno, oh, the Mickey Go uh, Thailand, that's pretty cool. 
uh, Mirabelle, a bunch of Disney 100 ones as well. Some Doug Days Pops, Yeti Center, that's a cool one. Over here we have a couple of the dwarfs from Snow White, that's pretty cool. Wally, -E, Earth Day exclusive, Fire Extinguisher Wally, -E. Gamer Mickey, that's a pretty neat one. Mickey Mouse for Holiday, Maui, Donald Duck, wow, sorry, it's really loud in here guys, there's a lot of people kind of just chatting and talking over there. Um, let's see, Pirates of the Caribbean Dog, Oswald the Lucky Rabbit, Angela, Dreamland Dumbo, lots of Dumbos in here, Rainbow Unicorn. You know what's funny, I actually forgot they made that Cinderella's Carriage one, that's definitely a cool piece. Oh, and up top there guys, they actually have Kevin with the Up House, another really great Disney exclusive. So here's some more Disney Pops, we do have uh, some of the Alice in Wonderland ones, Bullseye Toy Story, some Stitch right there, Hello Kitty. Uh, more Hello Kitty and Friends, some chases for the uh, Care Bears, which is really cool. Behemoth is really nice, Mulan. Some Toy Story ones. Um, Light Fairy is also really nice. Billy Butcherson, Gloomy Bear. Scooby-Doo, the artist series. I forgot about that one, oh my gosh. I'm so glad they stopped doing a lot of the art series. And speaking of, oh my gosh. I, I literally think this line is so bad, man. Anyways, moving on to more Disney, we have some of the uh, archive series, some of the trains as well, which is really nice, People Movers, Negatron, Frank from Jungle Cruise. Uh, oh, they have Pumbaa, that's pretty cool actually. I haven't seen that movie in a minute. Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas, Santa Jack. Another uh, train there, Ghost Cart. Let's see, we have some Lightyear Pops, Mickey and Friends, that's really nice. I'm not seeing any of the uh, Halloween Disney Pops, though, for Bailey, unfortunately. And then down here, if you guys want to see, they have some of the more the trading cards and comic covers. Up top there, guys, they have lots of stuff as well, a lot of bigger Pops. So we have, like, the Goku and Krillin 2-pack up in the left. We have some Yu-Gi-Oh! 6-inch Pops. Um, we also have the Iron Man with Gantry, Trafalgar Law with Polar Tang. They also have another one right there. Karama right there, two pack of Gentle Criminal, La Brava, Nezuko. Oh, they have a Morrowind, um, Elden Scrolls six inch pop up there, Immortal Hulk Chase. Lots of cool stuff up there. Over here, guys, they have the All Might and Deku two pack and ET three pack. Uh, we have Maleficent Disney, Holiday Mickey. Oh, Raven from That's So Raven, that's pretty cool. We have a Gretzko there, an old Mickey Mouse, or Minnie Mouse, excuse me. How old is this? Oh, this one's a restock actually from 2020, but there is an older pop of this. Now for any Pokemon fans, check this out. They kind of have this like framed Pokemon card, like uh, collage, I guess it is. So let's check this out. We have Kabutops, Zapdos, Muk, Raichu, uh, Hypno, Gengar, Articuno, love it, Moltres, Zapdos again. Lots of cool ones. I think there's a lot of repeats in here, but definitely some pretty cool ones. Aerodactyl, Ditto, Lapras, Dragonite. Definitely a really cool little collage photo. Hey guys, so we're back in the studio now and hopefully you did enjoy the Funko Pop hunt portion of this video. I wanted to make it a little bit longer because some of my recent hunts were a little bit shorter. I figured let's go all out. Let's show almost everything they have to offer there. Now I did in fact pick up two things there. The first one you guys saw earlier, which was the Blacklight Carnage here. Funko Shop exclusive, very excited about this one. So I bought this one to give away during my 100K live stream, just because I also wanted some Marvel kind of giveaways outside of anime. And then the other thing we picked up was a signed Kaido here. So check that out with the orange paint pen, looks really nice. Signed by the voice actor. So this will also be a giveaway during that 100K stream. Just a big thank you from me to you guys, basically. And again, details are coming soon for that. The only thing I'm just trying to figure out is exactly what date I want to do on it, just because we've been so busy lately. But I do have tons of giveaways that I can't wait to show you guys. With all that being said though, that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, as always, make sure to hit that like button down below, as well as subscribe and click that notification bell if you're new here. I do want to end off this video by saying a big shout out to all the wonderful Patreon supporters of the channel. You guys are rock for supporting myself and the channel. If you guys are interested and want to check it out, we do have a Patreon-only Discord where we share a lot of information, news, restocks, updates, links, and more. And lastly, make sure to be following me on all my social medias at Skittle Rampage over on Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, and my Facebook page so you can stay up to date. All right, love you guys. See you guys in the next one. See you guys later. Bye.